the power that you are, not that you have, not that you hold, not that you could possess, that you are, okay? Right now, regardless of how long you've been in this intensive, regardless of how many other, you know, therapy sessions or books or courses or so on that you have done, read, been in, listened to, okay? None of that matters. I want, In fact, I want you to forget all of that. I want you to center yourself. Okay, I want you to breathe in deeply. I want you to feel your feet planted on the floor. And I just want you to take your left arm, bring it out to your side, and bring it as far back as you can, as far back as it will possibly go, right? Take a look at where that is. Turn around. Your your arm is as far as it'll go. Turn around and see the spot on the wall or the shelf or whatever it is that you have behind you. Okay. And I want you to keep that in your mind. Remember that spot, you know, mark it mentally. I want you to turn your attention back to me. I want you to close your eyes. Close your eyes now as you listen to me. You are so flexible. You can move your arm as far back as you want. Your like a Gumby doll. I want you to look inside your shoulder. I want you to see the muscles inside your shoulder, just loosey goosey, like cooked noodles, cooked spaghetti noodles. All those fibers are so loose. They're so flexible. They can reach anywhere you tell your arm to go. I want you to just move, move your, like wiggle around your arm, just shake it a little bit. Look at how it's willing to do whatever you want it to do. Your arm can reach as far back behind you as you want it to go. And now when I ask you to reach your arm behind you, you're actually going to move it a third further than you did. You are looking at that spot in your mind. You're still, your, your arms are still at your side, but you're looking at that spot on the wall that you had reached before you have mentally marked it in your mind and now you see yourself do not move your arm yet you see yourself moving your arm past that mark past 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 that mark even further past that mark over a third further than you reached before and now i want you to just take your arm left arm and move it to your side and move it as far back as it can go far 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 back but remembering that you are gummy you are um, you are Gumby, you are flexible, you can do anything that your mind tells you to do. And now I want you to turn around. And I want you to take a look at where your arm is. It's at least a third past the place on the wall. You can sit down. Why do I show you this? I want you to show that the time is now. Okay, the time isn't in 10 weeks when you finished your first cycle. The time isn't, uh, you know, your first cycle of, of, of going through the exercises in this intensive. The time is not, you know, in a year when you got your dream job, when your debt is paid off, when you're remarried, when your kids are behaving, when your custody battle is done. The time is now. Your mind, your being is so powerful that whatever you tell to happen right now can happen. This is proof of that. You have full control over your body. You have full control over your health. You have full control over your words. You have full control over your connections and relationships, over your finances, over your job. You have full control over where you live and how you live, what food you eat. Don't make excuses right now. I don't have money. I don't have this. I don't have that. Stop. I just showed you proof. I just gave you living proof of what is possible with your mind. So today we're actually going to get into that. We're going to go over what is what is the uh, limitations that we have put on ourselves? What is the limitations in our minds that, that need, that are begging for us, in fact, to um, overcome? to move, to push through, uh, to eliminate, to destroy, to demolish, whatever. And we're going to find those out today.